Hey guys, Mitch here. Today I'll be showing you how to install Cydia on your jailbroken iOS 6 device. Now when we jailbroke iOS 6 in the past video, Cydia was not actually installed, but it only gave us the option to have remote access into our device via SSHing right into it. Now this process will allow you to SSH into your device, installing Cydia via a command prompt in terminal. Now to do this, we will have to notate our IP address right on our device. To do this, you can go into the settings, and then your network will appear. And then if you choose the blue arrow on the right here, you will be able to see your IP address. Right now, mine is 192.168.1.5, but yours will be different. Then if you head over to your computer, we can use an SSH client, either CODA2, or as many of you may have, is your simple Mac OS X terminal right here. Both programs will do the same exact thing, but CODA2 will cost you um, some money unless you want to use the free trial. So first off, in the server field, you want to go ahead and enter in the IP address of your iDevice here. Your username will be root, and your password will be alpine. Then once you have typed those in correctly, you can go ahead and connect and it will connect to your device over Wi-Fi. Now here you want to go ahead and paste in the code which will be in the description below and this will be loading the packages that allow us to install Cydia right on our device here. Now bear in mind Cydia is broken at the moment that's why there's no official jailbreak for iOS 6 so some packages may not be available. Your device will go to the Apple logo and once it has rebooted, you will be able to see that Cydia is now on our iOS 6 jailbroken device here. You can see right there it is. And if we go ahead and open it up, it will be preparing the file system, which you may have to wait a 5 to 10 minutes or so. And once the file system has been completed, you can go ahead and slide to unlock your device. And then you'll be able to open up Cydia, choose who you are and have access to all the packages available in Cydia. Now like I said before, not all these packages will be available to be downloaded and they may cause some issues with your springboard and whatnot, mainly because the, the developers are not updated to iOS 6 yet. So if you guys do like these videos, don't forget to give a like up, leave any comments below, and don't forget to subscribe to stay updated. Thanks guys.